Today is Tuesday. I'm recovering from a cold. The theater is cold. I'm recovering from a cold. I just did a half hour of running around, warming my body up. This project is about cultural mapping, body mapping, cultural landscapes on our bodies, on my body. It's about the body being home. It's about the body being a house. Maybe for some of the musicians in the project, for example, my friend Leah, perhaps her cello is a sort of extension of her body home, that it's sort of maybe a second house or maybe an addition that has been built and added on to her primary home of her body. My boyfriend of three years ended the relationship a month ago, claiming that I was boring. My body is my home. It involves me understanding the relationship between community and isolation and the importance of both, the importance of being a part of communities, being surrounded by humans, like a tree in a forest is very different than a tree on its own. Both are wonderful and both are very important respecting the time I have with people and making sure to give enough time to me as an individual in isolation with myself. Dealing with the word third culture, I am exploring, I'm exploring the combination of my U.S. citizenship with my growing up in being born in Pakistan, this creating a third culture. This is the culture in which I exist in. And, you know, it's an accumulation of all the countries that I've been in. It's an accumulation of my online culture, my identity online. Because I have put myself on the internet and created an identity for myself, and have chosen how it is that people perceive me. I have created a second person and my primary person in real life in combination with that secondary person creates who I am right now. I cannot separate myself from my online identity, from my Pakistani identity, from the Jessica who exists in relationship to all the people I've ever met, all the places I've ever been, and the situations. Relating this to performance, I see it as being in a space of performance is another world. This is a whole other culture where I can decide the customs, what is appropriate, what is inappropriate, I can decide upon the language that is spoken, the collection of languages, how it is that I communicate. The stage can become a third culture, the audience being one entity, me being another, creating this third place. It also exists between perhaps me and other performers in this space. I'm from one culture, this other performer is from another. Together we are creating this third entity, its own culture. Perhaps if it's improvisation and we haven't worked together, it's sort of in a very primal state of culture 
where language and communication has not yet completely been developed. Perhaps the things that we can really, the senses and the ways of communicating are very basic. We can see each other, we can feel each other's energy, smells. It's more of a sensual experience because we, the two cultures have not yet developed together enough to create maybe a language and tools. So it can be very basic. I think that's why I really like it because it's primal and very raw and sincere and real. It hasn't been complicated yet by ideas and manipulations. This is all the very beginning stages of me figuring out what all of this is. The connection between everything, if there is one. And my, I'm also interested in not worrying about narrowing it all down and concentrating it into a singular idea because exploring my body as my home, my house. I'm interested in making my own decisions. I'm very aware of what is usually expected and what is considered appropriate for project and art making, that ideas should be concise. I understand that and I'm capable of that, but maybe this is my time to investigate my house, my home, and make the decisions that I want. I think this is the beginning of my life, my career. I think I should allow myself to explore things and vomit everything that is inside of me because this is only the first 20 years of my life. I should be making work until I'm 80. So maybe by the time I'm 80, I will make more concise work because I have exposed everything within me and created all of the material to then organize.